everyone, so this is today's look. Um, it's really bright and bold and fun, and I used Glamour Girl eyeshadows uh, to create it. I used a lot of the greens and then a few blues. So, yeah, I hope you guys like the look. Um, I'll have links in the down bar to everything you need to know. Um, and yeah, so lots of videos, like I would say, to come up soon. Um, I'm kind of like going video crazy right now, although the reason so many videos haven't been up is because I've been having problems uploading. I just tweeted that this morning, like YouTube either just cancels my upload or it just stops halfway through. So I'm uploading a video right now. After I finish, I'm going to go check on it and it better have uploaded um, because it's getting really frustrating. Like I have these videos just sitting on my computer waiting to be uploaded. So hopefully that gets up so I can upload this one. So anyways, I hope you guys like the look and I will talk to you soon. Alright, so I already applied um, e.l.f. primer on my eyelid, and now I'm taking the NYX Jumo pencil in, um, I believe it's called Lemon. Looks like this. I deposited mine into this vitamin container, <laughs> um, but it's just a green. I'm going to take some on my finger and then put this all over the lid. Alright, now I'm going to take a small eyeshadow brush from Cindy Kashuk and get it damp. And then I'm going to take the color Oddity is a really fabulous color. It's like lime green, got some like gold sparkle in there. It's really unique. So I hope that focuses. And I'm going to get a little on my brush and then I'm going to pat this all over the lid. Alright, now I'm going to take an Essence of Beauty eyeshadow brush and the color Immature. Just a really beautiful like teal color. And it's not matte, but it doesn't seem to be as shimmery as the other colors. So I'm going to use this um, in the crease. So I'm just going to get a little bit from the cap. And just place that right in the crease. And I'm not going to take it too far up. Just going to kind of keep it right here. And I'm not using a piece of tape, but I am kind of going for that straighter edge. So if you want to kind of create that shape with your brush. Okay, now to blend Immature um, out, I'm going to take another color called Fabulous, which is also kind of a tealish color. It's more of like a blue. And I'm going to take what's in the cap on a, a large shadow brush from Cine Kashuk. Just get a little on there and then just blend it at the top of Immature. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and just apply the highlight color to my brow bone. And as usual, I'm using Cloud Coverage, which is a matte white color. And I am going to use this damp on an e.l.f. concealer brush. Alright, now for the outer corner, I'm going to take Olivia Green, which this is a matte color. It's a really, really pretty, kind of like a dark forest green. I don't know why, why I'm not holding these up closer. <laughs> I think it just takes a little bit longer to focus, and that's why, but that's what that color looks like. And I am going to get um, the brush I'm going to use a little damp. This is the e.l.f. contouring brush. Let's get a little bit damp. And I'm going to take this right on the outer V. Alright, now for the lower lash line. I'm going to take a um, e.l.f. small smudge brush and the Ulta color, um, what's the name of this color, Sapphire. It's a very, very dark navy. A Glamour Dolly's um, color that's similar to this would be Mind Reader uh, from the Twice Shadow Collection. It's uh, Edward's color. And I'm going to brush this on the lower lash line. Now for the top lash line, I'm just taking an angled brush and I'm going to get it wet 
And then I'm going to create a liner out of the color Mangles, which is a really, really fantastic royal blue color. That's what it looks like. And whenever I first apply it, it'll look like a darker blue, but then as it dries, it becomes a brighter, more royal blue. So I'm going to create some liner out of that, just in a cap, and then just apply that to my lash line. Alright, and now for the waterline, I'm taking an e.l.f. as a small precision brush, and I'm going to take the NYX General Pencil in Pacific, which is blue. You can use white, you can use black, you can use any color that you want. If you have maybe a dark green, you can use a dark green. And then I'm just going to apply this to the waterline. Alright, and then last step, um, I'm going to take a little bit of Milk Gemma Pencil, which is white, and I'm just going to pat that on the inner corner, just using my finger. Alright, so that is it for the shadow liner, so I'm going to go apply mascara and be right back. Alright, so now for lips, I'm just um, kind of erasing my lip color just a little bit with the e.l.f. lip primer. And then on top I'm just taking the Jessie's Girl Lip Gloss in Pink Lemonade. Just a really light pink. Alright, so that is it for this tutorial. So I hope you guys liked it and I will talk to you soon. Bye!